Hello everyone! Here is step dancer Felipe Galgani, also an instructor at Steps on Broadway. Today I will be teaching you a basic beginner level combination I created for my students a few weeks ago. If you have your tap shoes and your tap board, great! If you don't, you can also do it in sneakers or any soft shoe you might have. Now let's get to it! All right. So I divided this combo in three parts. We're gonna learn parts one, two, and three. If you have any questions, you can go back and see this step again. And then we're gonna do one time through, no music, and then with music. All right, I hope you enjoy and have fun. Here we go. We're gonna start with the waltz clog. Yeah, we're gonna do four waltz clog, starting on the right side. Watch this, it starts on count one. Right on one, two, three, four, one, two, three, then left side, then right, left, stop. Yeah, make sure you put your weight on the right side when you win because the second step it starts right on the left side and it's sugar, sugar. It's only steps and I have that little twist. I go. Right after that, I have big toe step, big toe step. Go from the beginning. One, two, three. We go right side, left, right, left, step. Eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Big toe step. Dip toe step you starts on the left side and I finish with my left side up. I'm gonna do from here, now starting part two. Part two goes brush step, brush step, brush step, brush step. Again, two, three, we go. Yes? From that, I have this step that I love. It's a crossing step. And it happens in double time, you see. Watch this, left side. Step, heel, step, heel, step, heel, toe, heel, step, heel, step, heel, step, heel, toe. So the right side is shorter, right? There's no heel on the right side. I go left, right, one, two, three, four, right, left, one, two, three. Now I'm gonna Cross that toe heel, the second toe heel crosses in front. One and cross. One, two, three, four. One and cross. One, two, three. All right, putting it together from the brush step. Two, three, we go. change, yeah, in the rhythm, that's the goal of this short combo, right? It's short rhythm changes. One, two, three, we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight. Very good. From here, I have a sequence of pedal and row. Watch this. So, that's the challenging part of our dance. It's making that step really the transitions clear. The way, my tip for you right now, it's counting. I'm gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, a two, a three, a four, a five, and a six, and a seven, and a eight, and a one. Quarter notes, swing eighth notes, triplets. Yeah, that's the transition there. Let's do it. It's starting on the left side and it's all paddle and row. So I'm going to face front once. Left side. Two, three, we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, a two, a three, a four, a five, and a six, and a seven, and a eight, and a one. And 
that's the last step. That's the part three of our combo. So, if you shift your weight every time in the end of the step to the last sound, you're gonna be able to do the transitions, yeah? So if you have problem with the transitions, you have to shift your weight. Go from the beginning, part one, walk squat. One, two, three, we go. Right, step, east. Now let's do it with music. We are dancing to How High the Moon. It's a jazz standard. This version is from the Dave Brubeck Quartet. And we are starting right in the beginning of the song. Yeah, it gives us three chords and then we go. Let's do it. My email is infogalgani at gmail.com. I'm also teaching online classes, so hit me up. And otherwise, I will see you at Steps. I'm there every Sunday. Can't wait to see you. Bye.